Fans, what's going on? Today we're going to talk about the Sacramento Kings and how well they did in the NBA draft last night. Now, they did have the 12th pick in the first round, and yes, they surprised me and so many other people with drafting Jason Thompson, power forward at 6'11 from Ryder. Now, Jason Thompson worked so hard in all these workouts. I even saw some behind the scenes stuff on, on TV with how well he was doing in workouts. And yes, the Sacramento King, they got a good talent. All they got to do is develop a couple of things within him, and he'll be a great power forward for the Sacramento Kings. He is obviously, and I mean obviously, going to help that front line, Mikey Moore and Brad Miller for the Sacramento Kings. Now, Sacramento, they, 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 had, they had opportunities to get prob probably Costa Cufo, J.J. Hickson, Murray Spades. They probably even had a couple other opportunities with other big men, probably even Roy Hibbert. But at the end of the day, they went with Jason Thompson, and I think he's going to be a great guy that will fit in very well with the Sacramento Kings. Then, in the second round, the 42nd and 43rd picks, they did good. They went, they got Sean Singletary. He's a point guard slash shooting guard. He can shoot the ball, but I don't know if he's going to be able to play the point guard position, but we'll have to wait and see. I think Sacramento will, try, will probably try to make a move and probably get a, better, a veteran point guard somewhere along the lines. Um, during this offseason, maybe they won't. But 43rd pick, they get a great defender in Patrick Ewing Jr., 6'7", small forward from Georgetown. Patrick Ewing Jr. is a great talent. They, he'll have to develop a couple of more things on the offensive end, but he's going to bring intensity and tenacity. Having him and Mikey Moore on one team, forget it. If Sacramento decides to keep Ron on test, that would be also a great move for them. I think Sacramento is going to do nothing but improve for next season. I don't know if they're going to be an NBA playoff team in such a tough Western Conference. I'll say Portland has more of an opportunity to get into the NBA playoffs than Sacramento right now. But Sacramento is on the uprise, and I think that they are going to be a very, very good team down the line. So, B-plus for the Sacramento Kings as far as my grade goes. I'm happy for them, Reggie Theus, and the Sacramento organization, Jeff Petrie. Jeff Petrie did a great job in the NBA draft. Kudos, thumbs up, the great star. And Jason Thompson, he's going to end down the line. And that is my report on the Sacramento Kings. I'm Jamil Crothers.